Development Center. How are you? I'm doing fine. How are you? Lots has changed over the over the last year since I was here, right? Yes. Yes. You had 60 people in your program. How many do you have now? We have 127 people in the program. Oh my goodness! And do you still place them all in within Valiant? We are becoming saturated with students. We have 127 in the program now. We're looking forward to training, third-party training for other companies now, so we can keep this great program moving forward. And we can train up to 120 to 160 students a year. Wow, that's exciting. So what do you think about the challenge of the skilled workforce? Where do you think, uh, you know, does it have to start? Well, I think it has to start with industry, because the government won't do anything until the industry shows interest. So this is how we can convince the government to get on board. Industry has to take charge and they have to bring on the young people to replace the older uh, retirees that are coming up on board. And we, you can have a lot of work in the company, but if you don't have the people to satisfy the customer, uh, you have an issue coming up. The customer will eventually pull the work out of the company and move, move elsewhere. And it could be probably offshore. So we need to keep the, the business back in case. Awesome. Well, Vali and the you certainly show positive action here. Is it possible for me to speak to some of your students? Yes, sure. No problem. I'm sure they'll be interested. Awesome. So let's get going. Steve. Hi, how are you? Good. Thanks so much for speaking to me. No problem. Thank you for doing this interview. Yeah. So I just spoke briefly to Mike Ouellette who started the whole thing together with Valiant. Mm -hmm. And so I, it's important for me to speak to a couple of students. What would you say did this program do for, for your personal life? Well, before this, I used to work a minimum wage job, which was made it really hard financially and just to live. But with this job, it's above. I get a skill. It totally gave me a different outlook all on life, all on work, how to use your brain rather than your muscles because it's like one of the most powerful muscles you have, correct? And instead of going home tired every night, why not just think work smart and not harder? So do you enjoy it? Oh, I love it. This is amazing. It's the best experience. I come 6 o'clock in the morning, most people aren't really awake. Wow. I'm up with a smile just because I'm ready to go to work. Oh. I'm happy to be here. I'm, I just have a smile on all day. I love it. I can't, I can't believe it. I'm so happy. Awesome. Oh. So what, what advice would you give somebody else? Why should they get into a manufacturing program like this or consider a career manufacturing? Because you come up with a trade. You come up with something that not everyone can do. You come up like with me being a CNC machinist at the end. Not everyone can say, hey, I can run a CNC machine or I can run a CNC manually or a bridge port. Or you just dif it differentiate yourself from everyone else. It just, it's, it's a really remarkable program, what they have doing here, and I'm blessed to be a part of it. Hello, Tasha. How are you today? I'm good. How are you? Good. So, a couple of questions for you. I just spoke to Steve, but now I want to hear from you a little bit. Like, what has this program done for you in your personal life? Um, it's opened my eyes huge. Before I started this program, I was at home with my two little boys doing nothing, just being a stay at home mom. But then I needed an income of some sort because I'm a single mom. So I handed in my resume to Mike and then I came here. Okay, perfect. So you have to be super organized when you are a single mom with two little boys. So yes. Everything has to be over, huh? Yeah, it's really, really hard. Every morning I wake up at 5.30, pack the lunches, and then get myself ready, get that ready, and then off to work I come. Wow, that's amazing. So do you enjoy working here? You, you have more guys and girls around you, so yeah. do they treat you well? Yeah, they do. Yeah. I'm like their mom. I tell them all what to do. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. That is awesome. <laughs> so what advice would you give other young women in this case now? Why should they consider a manufacturing career? Um, if I were to give anybody any advice to come into manufacturing, it's a great opportunity for women to get into. There's not a lot of women in this industry right now, so it's a great opportunity for anybody right now. And what do you think bring women to the table? What, what is the difference between you and the other guys? 
Personally, I don't see any kind of difference between me and the other guys on the floor. Like, I can physically do anything that they're doing. Okay. So there's no setback. Do you notice me. a difference in the way how you think, how they think? Um, I've noticed myself that I'm more like critical and make things look more pretty than okay. the guys do. <laughs> okay. So that's a big thing, but. <laughs> John, hi, how are you? Thank you. Good, thank you. So thanks so much for the opportunity to speak with you. I interviewed Mike and two other students before you. Uh, I would just like to know what does this program do for you in your personal life? Um, it got me out of the food industry, that's for sure. Um, I what what was your something. job before? Tim Hortons. Tim Hortons. Yeah, serving coffee. Okay. But, you know, going to work there every day was a stress, dealing with people, doing things I didn't like to do. Coming into here, I actually to learn, you know, think, uh, use my brain a lot more than using my people skills. It's, it's interesting. Okay, so you use your brain more here, yeah. huh? A lot of thinking, a lot of math. Okay. But not so hard. You enjoy that? Oh yeah, for sure. Yeah? That is awesome. So, and how is the interaction with uh, the other guys in the program? Do you enjoy it? Oh yeah, it's a good atmosphere. Yeah? yeah? No complaints there. Yeah, no complaints. No complaints about the trainer either? Oh no, <laughs> trainer. One piece of advice for other young people who who are out there and not sure what career they should choose, why could they or should they consider a career in the manufacturing industry? Well, if you're looking for a career that is challenging but rewarding, uh, something that you get to use your brain, you get to think, you get to come into work every day and think about what you're doing and creating you know, pieces of work, uh, and you should Maybe look at the machine. Okay. Perfect. Are they good? I'm just going to look at the camera. You're saying something. No. Not really. <laughs> you're going to look at it. <laughs> <laughs> not really. Okay. Is it on? Yeah. Okay, awesome. Hi, Lilla. How are you doing? Good. Thanks so much for speaking to no me. Worries. Perfect. So, one question. What has this program done for you in your personal life? Um, this program, for my personal life, I've met people here that I actually hang out with outside of work. So I think gaining a friendship with those people actually helped me gain a better working relationship, so a stronger bond. Um, making work a little bit easier and more enjoyable to actually be here. Um, it's brought in my horizons um, as far as future careers and knowledge and everything like that. So it's made me um, uh, a smarter person in general. So. Uh, I have to thank the, relate, or the program for that. Um, that, yeah. is, that is perfect. Yeah. So you think yeah. this helps you also to become more productive, right? Sure. When you have the people, you enjoy right. the people around yeah. you. Yeah, you all connect, everything connects. You know, and you can ask them for um, questions and they're, they're willing to go out of their way to help you. Um, and Mike is a, a, a great person to go and ask questions for. Brought me, uh, you know, a long way in this program. So it's, it's awesome. Perfect. So you yeah. really enjoy working here now? I get up every day and I, I don't I don't regret it. So Okay, yeah. that's yeah, awesome. good. Yeah. So I mean, do you have one piece of advice you would give uh, a young person who why you should consider a manufacturing career? Um the the money potential is, is there as long as you show up to work and, and you have a good attitude and outlook on life and um, you know, you can have a good life if you like this. So yeah, it's, it's good all around. You certainly look like a person who has a good outlook on life. Yeah, I, I like to think so. <laughs> okay, perfect. <laughs> Thanks so much for no speaking worries. to me. No worries, thank okay. you very much. Thanks, yeah. bye. bye.